And now onto our dinosaur of the day, Coronosaurus, which was a request from Dinosaur 4602. So thanks. It was a Lambiosaurine hadrosaur that lived in the Cretaceous in what is now China, and it's estimated to be about 33 feet or 10 meters long. It's one of the largest known hadrosaurs from Asia. Scientists found a partial skull in parts of an adult and juvenile, and the partial skull looks like a Parasaurolophus. Coronosaurus probably had a long, hollow crest like Parasaurolophus, and this helps show that Lambiosaurines lived later than their relatives in North America, because it lived later than Parasaurolophus. The type species is Coronosaurus giayanensis. It was found in 2000 by Godfroyd, Zan, and Jin on the south bank of the Amur River, which divides China and Russia. And the genus name means Coron's lizard. It refers to Coron, the ferryman who took souls from the river Styx to the land of the dead, and it's named because the dinosaur was found on the river that borders China and Russia. I don't think it's saying anything about China or Russia. It's just the fact that it was on a river. <laughs> yeah. I was going to say that's a dark reference. Yeah. That's the river you pick. <laughs> <laughs> the species name, of course, refers to Jiayin, the locality where it was found. For those of you who listen to our Dinosaur of the Day segment and you like it, please consider becoming a patron. We take new Dinosaur of the Day requests from our patrons and offer a bunch of other perks as well. So check out our page at patreon.com slash inodino or click the link on the left.